What's up guys, Iovo here, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to make your very own profile picture in a matter of minutes for absolutely free using a software or website called Pixlr. Now Pixlr is a website which allows you to make graphics and the reason we're going to be using Pixlr is because it is very simple to use and there are no downloads at all. So all you want to do is go on Pixlr.com and then launch the web app for the Pixlr editor and then wait for that to open up. So once it's opened up, just go to File and New Image, and we're going to create a new image. We are going to make the width 500 and the height 500 as well, and just make the background transparent and click OK. So as you can see, the checkered box right now is going to be where our profile picture is going to be designed. This is the actual profile picture, and now we have to add a background to it. So we are here at trusty Google Images where we have to find a background for this profile picture. Now it's really easy to find backgrounds. You just have to search for the right words. So for example, you can search for a sunburst background. So if I search for blue sunburst, you can see that you can have a sunburst background. If you want something more aggressive, you can search for a grunge background and you can see these look much more aggressive. And if you want, you can also search for gradient backgrounds, which are more you know calming and simple and just find a background you like. So I like the look of this background. So I'm gonna click on view image, right click, save image as, and just save it as blue gradient and click okay. And it should be saved. So now we have to make this new image, the background image of our profile picture. So we're going to go to file, open image, and then we're going to put in the image. So it was called blue gradient, I believe. Yup, it's right there, click open. And it's going to open as a separate document. Now all you want to do is press Control A, Control C, it's Command if you're on Mac, and then go back to the original profile picture file and then click Control V to paste it in. And then we can get rid of this by deleting it and we're not going to save changes. Now using the selection tool you can actually move around this background and have it as you see fit. And you can also go to edit and then go to free transform and transform the size and proportions of this background image so you can make it bigger and smaller and I think it looks good right there and there we go we have the background so now we're going to create a new layer apply the changes and make some text so adding the text is also very simple you just have to click on the text tool click on the background and then type in whatever you want so I'm going to call this oh uh, we're going to call this big Joe that's going to be the channel name and we're going to have it be two lines like so. And here we can change all the settings of the text. So we're going to make the size a lot larger. We are going to make the color white. Click OK. Uh, we can also change the style and make it bold and change the font as well and, font and find a font we like. So I like the font Batman Forever. Now if you have any fonts downloaded, they should show up here as well. And then just click on the font you want. And then finally we're going to center align it so that everything is centered and then click on OK. Now we can also add some effects to the text once we're done actually typing it out. All you want to do is make sure the text layer is selected and then click on this button with the little burst on it. And from here you can add five different styles. So I'm going to see which ones look good. And as you can see, the bevel makes it look 3D, which is pretty cool. So I'm gonna add a bevel and I'm also going to add a drop shadow and that looks pretty cool. And I'm gonna click OK. And finally, the last thing you have to do is go to File, save and save this image so you can call it whatever you want i'm going to call this big joe we're going to save it as a jpeg and move the quality up to 100 and click on ok and we can save it wherever we want and it's going to be downloaded there and there we go we're done and that's about it for this video guys like i said this is a very simple tutorial on how to make a basic profile picture for free now if you guys want you could always experiment and learn other features of pixlr and add them to your profile picture or you can use other softwares like photoshop but this is a very basic tutorial and it's going to help you have a profile picture set up in a matter of minutes so hopefully you guys did enjoy this video if you did be sure to give it a big thumbs up and as always thanks for watching my name is iovo and i'm signing out